Good evening, folks. I'm the voice of Dog, and this is Casey Azami and Starseeds. Him to the earless god. If you remember Casey Azami, he created Jimmy and the Pulsating Mass, which is a game I enjoyed very much. And I've been waiting for another game from him ever since he told me about it in uh, a stream that we did a while back with Rockus. Ooh. Ooh, nice animation. I like all these guys. All these guys are cool. Uh, I saw the character art for them and was immediately drawn in. Any preferences, chat? I didn't think we'd have a choice. I kind of figured it would be one story. Or something completely different, not in the game. Mantis. I hear Mantis. Okay. Not playable in the demo. Awaiting her own ritualistic suicide. So, if you read the backstory for these characters, uh, they're all pretty dark. Um, this is a very hostile world. Kind of based off of Lennis, known as Paladin's Quest. Uh, I played that game a few years back. It's up on my YouTube. You can check that out if you want. Uh, the first and second are available. Who else do we have? Flem. Pox. Opening story, your first full level available in the demo. Partial first level available in the demo. Okay, so let's do the um, let's do the short one first, and then we'll do the long one. <gasps> Look at these guys. Oh my god. This well, okay, I like the sound effect that's here. <laughs> it's just like, you know, some pixie dust or whatever. But I I imagine Zahando from part four of JoJo. Because it seems like she is eating through space time. Maybe that is her ability. Okay, let's throw ourselves into things. We've got three characters. I have 30 HP, which is not a lot. Oh, this is like Lennis. So, okay, we've got uh, spells, text, defend, potion, attack. Okay. Devour. Mana Song. Black Ritual. 200% magical damage. Requires both Whisper and Sleep. Oh, I don't have any TP. Okay. Ah, spells and techs are different. Enchant yourself so that those who strike you will be inflicted with a sleeping curse. Counters melee attacks with two sleep last five turns. Mm, not bad. Heal for 500% intelligence. Subsequent use is less effective. Okay. Potion. Uh, these are my items. Create potion. Just trying to absorb what all this stuff does real quick. Well, let's attack. Let's attack the guy who's going to go first, assuming that that's a... Uh, uh, this is an order of turn bar here. Oh. 
Oh, I thought we were playing as girl bug. But no, we were, I was playing as one of the bodyguards. Okay, I see now. I did not read my things correctly. What are your techs? You've got Mana Song and Black Ritual. You've got Nightmare and Moonbeam. 200% damage, 300% damage to sleeping characters. So there's some synergy going on here. I also heard about a mechanic where you can eat enemies that are low on HP or dead. Stab. You don't want to eat? You're not hungry? I kind of figured you, you're the one who needs it, right? Mana Song. Seek pity from a long dead god. Revives an ally to half health. One use per battle. He's an ally for 250%. Removes all poison. Alright. Okay, that heals. All right, we get a little bit of health for winning that. I assume survival is going to be big in this game. This looks helpful. Okay, our name is Capella. When attacking in battle, your range is limited. If you have a ranged weapon, you can hit anything, but characters who use melee weapons won't be able to hit creatures in the back row if there are other creatures in front of them. True for your party as well, so put your weaker characters in the back row. Be careful. Ranged attackers and magic casters can still get you. Okay. Ah, that's a treasure chest. Or I'm allowed to harvest... Oop, I didn't even see you there. What is Whisper? I wonder. Alright, your physical is quite strong. Okay, that takes time to charge. Whisper and Sleep are our dudes. Okay. <laughs> hey, what the? Level up. I have to admit, there's a lot of information right now. I'm not absorbing it all yet. Okay, that's just setting. Let's take a look at our equipment. Whisper, Sleep, Capella. Waxing Moon, Ritual Robe, Ritual Hood. Yeah, I kind of figured I jumped into the deep end, but isn't that fun? <laughs> isn't it fun to just not play the, the game the way it was meant to be played? Okay, so we got Waxing and Waning Moon Swords, HP Thief, Moon Power, Cosmic Streamer, Spiritual Absorption. Yes, this is the sequel to Bug Fables. No, it's a different dev. What is the bonus in there? What does bonus mean? Do we have any AoE? Oh, 
Let's knock one of you out. Wow, that's a lot of MP to lose, but they are called mana leeches. Did I get that MP back when I killed him? Interesting. Whose turn is it? Whisper? Whisper seems like he can one-shot anything right now. Okay. I seem to be adequately powerful for this so far. That, uh, that seems like that'll kill me if I touch it. Wrong ally. Oh, you're right. I gotta differentiate between the two. Charge? Sixty HP, but he's got something on him. Let's charge. Poison stay after the battle. Does not seem like it does. Okay, we're we could be in trouble here. All right, let's get in some damage before they start making themselves harder to hit. Good. That was a good choice. Well, I do have a healer in the pack row. Oh, I can't hit the guy in the back. Might as well hit the one that isn't poison. Thank you. 
All right. Four of them weren't too bad. We're not that aggressive. Ah! Okay. Oh no! I got negative 8 MP? Do I die? Am I dead? <laughs> Is that good? Is that a bug, maybe? Oh wait, now I'm at zero MP. That was a bug. I owe that creature MP. So this game is going to do like Chrono Trigger style encounters, which I like. You can use your brain a bit to uh, avoid encounters. Or you can run into all of them, like I do. Oh, you need to select. Oh, I didn't even realize that that's how the menu looks. Um, okay, so what's happening here is that you need to select potions and then the character that is going to use it. But do I have anything that can restore MP? Wait, I just saw something. Makes potions also restore 25% MP, can stack with itself. I see. Students in the Magic Guild chew these herbs when cramming for exams. I see. This is like uh, Octopath apoc uh, Apothecary stuff. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. So you basically craft the potion you need for the moment. Uh, we're looking at the demo. Uh, not, nothing has been explained. This is just like a partial dungeon uh, that has been previewed with this party. But let me link you to the Kickstarter, because I haven't done that yet. And I should absolutely do that. The Kickstarter has uh, a little blurb about the four characters. This game also takes a bit from Live Alive in the sense that it's got four acts that will come together uh, that you can play in any order, presumably. Uh, we are playing as the second character, Capella. So, what does it say about her? Uh, she is the last of the Suaru. She lives in Dream, a small town in the fo in a forest by Dewdrop City. The Om that have raised her also revere her. She is the chosen one, after all. She will give birth to God. The time of the ritual is almost at hand, so she must begin her journey. Joined by two warrior priests of the Moonlight family, she sets off to the Moonlight Temple to perform her sacred duty. However, something inside is pulling her away from her path, away from God. Feelings that shouldn't be possible in a world like this. Feelings that only she has, for she is the last of a great tribe, a tribe that could feel. Interesting. Hello. Hello? Can I interact with you? I guess not. Apple of Plenty. Ah.
Nice, thank you, Kefka. Yeah, this is from Casey Azumi, and uh, he's new. Uh, he's working with some people, I think. Uh, I'm not aware of the of the team yet, uh, but I, I know he's got an artist at least. Nice crit. Already back to the highest tier. Nice. Thank you so much. We got a ways to go. Okay, so they both uh, did Poison Touch to their skin. So do I, how does this work? Kickstarter is mostly to pay for the art. Okay, I gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, I can see where it's going. Uh, can I knock this guy out? I can't. I can... Alright, how bad could it be if I run face first into poison damage? Can I end this battle before it gets really bad? Seems like I can run my way through that. If I make the battle short short enough. Slime. Oh, I just realized that she's like kind of pumping her arms when she, but she's wearing like a dress with long sleeves, something with long sleeves. Increases a creature's mental endurance. I couldn't possibly. Please, someone else take it. Okay. Yeah, I can definitely hear Casey's uh, uh, style in the music. What? Uh, mental endurance? So it should go to sleep then. That was correct. Yes. Sleep is the wizard. Concern of ours. But it is not. I don't understand your point. You're right. Praise God. <laughs> but that was not the right path. There you go. Sleep has got it. Is there a save? Okay, there we go. Hollow Carapace. Nice animation there. Ah! <laughs> I should have known. Thread splitter. Thread spitter hatchling. Who's up? Oh. 
Nice. That's a nice uh, animation on that cast. I like that. Minus agility. And it displays above their... Uh, it displays above their... Whatchamacallit? Their bar. Oh, no. This is full of spiders. Why did I do that? Of all the horrible things that could have happened. Oh, no! Oh, shit. Is that a game over? Could be a problem. So they get free hits on me when that happens. <laughs> I like how she waves her stick around in the air. <laughs> Gotta hit him in the front. See if I can pull this off. Okay. Wow, four of those guys are dangerous. Do I dare open the other one? Yes, I do. Huh? Yeah, I have a feeling I know what that is, but I also want to see what's up ahead. That's definitely a battle. Gotta get rid of you guys quickly. Good, eat his MP. Indicator of on the bottom of the screen of who's up, whose turn it is would be a little nice. You know, like their their background lights up or something. I keep looking at the bottom of the screen to see whose turn it is, and that doesn't tell me whose turn it is, and it keeps confusing me a little bit. Monster blood. Mandible necklace. Oh boy. Pella, do you want a new necklace? 
Gain three attack. The yellow bar under the HP is hunger? Oh. I thought it was experience. Huh, I'm hungry. Yeah, I want you to have the three attack. Sleep doesn't have any hunger right now. Hmm. I am on a journey to meet God. Oh, and it's got rankings for proficiencies and stats. Vegetarian, empathy, mana sensitive. Oh, that's why she won't eat. Okay. All right. Well, something to pay attention to, then. New adorable bug world. Sorry, adorable hostile bug world. Hmm. I got lost just now. <laughs> Well, it's a good thing I cleared out the encounters, right? Oh, right, right, yeah. Maybe it's time to heal, wizard. No, that's a self-heal. No. 
please don't eat my mana. Uh, he's in the back row. God damn it. Capella? There we go. Oh no, Capella gets it because she hit it. Oh no. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh no. No, he will not. It is the key's nature to be father for larger creatures. Do you want the butterflies to go extinct? Or do you want the spiders to go extinct? Seven hundred HP. I wish I had some MP right about now. Hey, okay. I do first? Do I try to break those? That might work against me. I'll have Capella go for it. Okay. Okay. Does hurt him. Okay. All right, new guy. What do you got? Swamp gas, sludge bomb, putrid skin. All right, blind the enemy. Okay. Attack and add extra poison stats. Okay, I need TP for that. Counter physical attack with poison. Well, let's see how much damage you can do. Not a lot, but you apply poison. Oh boy. use a potion on myself. Alright, fine, I'll wait.
There we go. Alright, we're starting to build up some TP finally. Plus 27 poison. That's pretty good. Poison might be the, the key here. Oh, that looks cool. Nice. guy's accuracy a little bit. 12% is not a lot, honestly. But he is hitting twice. So let's have all our shit go off here. Yeah. Keep thinking she has an, an attack, a magic attack. She does not. What gives you more TP? I've been trying to figure it out, but I'm unable to. Set regen per turn. Okay. Ah, kind of figured. Um.
That's right. I think we got him. As long as you keep your front line up. Concentrated filth. Thank you for playing the demo. <laughs> hey, folks, uh, this is him to the earless god. If you like what you're seeing, feel free to check out the Kickstarter, which you can find right here. That's true. Even if you can't contribute anything, letting other people know helps out a lot. Nice. All right, let's go chapter one then. guy <laughs> okay all right get in the hole
All right. <laughs> oh God. Great. I do not have a complex. You have a complex. <laughs> this is gonna be fun, I can tell. Oh, we're gonna get thrown into the hole now. Look at this bug empire. Shit, through the cave. <laughs> no, you join my army. Fox is having a bad day. <laughs> Decreases critical hit damage by 25%. Shit. Grit. Okay. Ah. <laughs> 
Hi. Yeah, sure. Can I kill two of these guys? They are bleeding. I did not play Blasphemous. Kind of Metroidvania. Uh, hi. You look like you will immediately murder me. Join my army! No, I didn't even know there was a first one. I, that one I didn't really uh, notice, to be honest. Ooh, clothing. One defense. I'll take it. Oh no! <laughs> Damn. don't have the old clothing yet.
Bonus turns. Will not be able to cast magic. You have the option to charge, which will grant you a temporary buff to your magic damage. As well as allowing the floor regenerates the trigger. Enemies can also get bonus turns. I was thinking of eating the guy. FD meter. Satiated. Okay. Plant-based monsters can't be eaten unless you're a vegetarian. If a monster dies with some status effects, such as poison, those status effects will remain on the corpse and transfer to whoever eats it. Try to avoid eating corpses like that. That guy was helpful. He can live. Hi. Like if I start a fight in here, it'll be bad. Who wants to band together? Alright, what ha- Oh, yeah, there's your treasure back there. Alright, what happens if I attack you? The code! He broke the code! Kill him! Oh god, I'm so dead. Should I see if I can fight that? Let's find out. Z. 
diseased. Oh, I think I'm in trouble. <laughs> okay. Junk hell. Oh, no. I gotta eat them, though. shit. I will kill her. Same, dude. We'll all kill her together. Thank you for playing the demo. <laughs> it's very abrupt. <laughs> it's so abrupt. <laughs> All right. All right. Impressions. Here, let's uh. Yeah, I should eat that guy. I like the, the music in this area. So, once again... Here's the Kickstarter. Uh, I have not pledged yet, but I will be soon. So far, uh, I am really interested in the battle system. Like, it took me a little while to discern uh, these two characters apart from each other, but that was just me learning the system. Uh, there was definitely a feast, feast versus famine kind of thing going on between the two chapters, so that was neat to see. Uh, the potion system is interesting, but I need a lot more ingredients, I think. Yeah, I want to see more of these characters. Good, like, meaty demo. With a lot of promise.
yeah, I want to see the four characters, you know, develop their story and and get together and destroy Bug God. Him to the eyeless god. Earless god. Sorry. No ears. Can't hear. This song's for you. <laughs> 